Hello everyone. Did you have a go at making your own broomstick? Did you enjoy it? I really enjoyed making it. Today we're going to describe how my your broomstick works. You are going to describe how your broomstick works. I'll show you my broomstick. Here it is. And I'll tell you how it works. It has this big long seat because that's where my granddaughter and the cat butterfly are going to sit. I'll sit on top here. In here it has beautiful, lovely, cozy, fluffy cushions because when a Louisa and a butterfly are tired, they can cuddle up or huddle up together and go to sleep. It has also a very smooth, soft blanket so that when it gets cold, Louisa can be covered up to keep her warm. It has this string. I know butterflies, a cat loves pulling strings. So if it starts raining, butterfly will pull the string and the lid will come down and they won't get wet. It has windows they can still see through if they want the lid down or to stop the sun shining in their eyes. They can still see through the windows. And because it's a very, very long way from here to Uganda, I made it like into a kind of a rocket so that it can fly really, really quickly and get to Uganda before Eloisa gets too tired. She's only a baby, so she's only one year. So we don't want her to get really tired. That's why it can fly really, really fast like a rocket. And, go, and so that Louisa can get to see her great granddad within no time. Tell me about your broomstick. What can it do? What special features has it got? Wow, I think all your teachers are waiting to hear about your posting.